What's up guys, Wicked Street Media here, and today we're going to be showing you how to detail your wheels our way. So there's many other ways out there, this is just the way that we feel is the best, and then we're actually going to be putting the stock wheels back on this car. If you've seen some of the videos before, I have work CR2P wheels on here. So we're going to be taking those off, fully detailing those, getting ready for the next season coming up in the spring. Meanwhile, this thing's going to be sitting on the stock wheels just as it rests in here in the garage for the winter. So the products that we will be using today to do those procedures will be. We we'll start off with some Adams shampoo and get those nice and cleaned up. And we're gonna go behind it with some Mother's aluminum polish. So let's let's show you how to do this stuff. So we got the stock wheels back on the car now. We're gonna get the other side up, get those wheels off, and then we'll get started on the detailing process. So the first step of detailing your wheels is going to be getting um, any surface stuff, all the dust, all the grime that's on top. Gonna be scrubbing that off, and then we can get back to using all the polishes and anything else that's gonna go into this. So what we did was we filled up this bucket here with the Adams Polishes Car Shampoo, and then we got it this brush that we're going to be using to scrub out the wheels and get all the dirt and grime off of it. And then we're going to be going back to the house to use that uh, mother's aluminum wheel polish. Now that you have completed washing the excess crap off and scrubbing it, getting all that grime and dust that's been sitting on there, you're going to now dry off the wheels and then we'll get back into the polishing and all the chemicals, all the chemicals that you're going to be using to finalize the whole cleaning process and detailing process. All right guys, after you're done doing the pre-wash, make sure that you get the wheels completely dry because this will be an important step to move forward with the detailing process. So make sure completely dry. Uh, what we did was air dry them. You can use microfiber to dry it off or air dry as well. It's up to you. All right, so the first um, step in the process of fully detailing the wheels, we're starting on the back of the wheels. These wheels have been on the car and in use for a couple a couple months now. We're using the Mother's Aluminum, Mother's Aluminum Polish and starting on the back like I said and you really just kind of want to rub it in and cover every surface area on the entire wheel. I applied a small amount of polish to a terry cloth towel. I rubbed polish onto the metal surface until a black residue appeared, which I don't see any. Oh, but that looks nice though. Damn. So, the first step for cleaning the aluminum on your wheels is you want to get a nice microfiber and get a good little dab of the stuff. And that's what you take to go wiping around uh, the area that you're going to start cleaning. And then you move on to a different microfiber. And once that residue has kind of had a little bit of time to settle, you go back in and scrub it out. And it gets it a pretty good and nice shine on the aluminum. So I don't know if you guys can see this, but the outside rim. This is where we just got the cleaning done with the polish. And then on the inside here, you can see we have not touched there. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's all nice and grimy and crap. Um, and then up here is a completely different wheel, a lot more shiny and looks brand new. So this stuff is working pretty good. Alright, last part of the full cleaning job, um, we are going to finish off the complete inside of the whole wheel and that should be 
that will be the last part of completely detailing these. The steel cleaner or the aluminum cleaner worked perfectly. Uh, completely shiny and buffs out all the junk. We will put a link to that aluminum cleaner in the description below. Also, we're gonna have the Adams Polishes whole site in the description below, so if you'd like to get any of that stuff for yourself, feel free to do so. So, I finished this one up. Could use a little more on the inside just to get it totally done, but it doesn't look too bad. Looks a lot better. This will be nice because the car is sitting in the garage until the winter season is over, until the STI comes back out. So the day that he brings it out, already got some fresh wheels. We'll probably be using the same stuff over the season um, when it comes around to keep it looking clean out to every show that we're going to keep Have you, it fresh. If you haven't seen what shows we're going to, we'll link that up at the top and you can try to see if you can meet us there. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoyed learning how to detail your wheels, uh, let us know in the comments below and we can do some more videos like this to show you other methods that we use to help keep our cars clean. If you have any tips or tricks or if we should do something different, feel free to drop them down there too. And also, Make sure you go back and watch the video we were just talking about to find out all the trips that we're going on this season so you guys can meet up with us, possibly do a car shoot depending on what car you have. So hit us up. You can leave a comment down below or go follow all of our social media. That's also in our link. Go follow the Snapchat and the Instagram. Hit us up. But once again, thank you guys so much for watching and peace out and stay wicked.